Ladies and gentlemen, I'm level 27 Marker Man, and this is Let's Play The Legend of Zelda a Link to the Past. Last time we got uh, the enhanced boomerang and shield and the flippers. This time we're gonna take on the Tower of Hera! Top Death Mount. Ben, it is I, Saha Sarla. Advice dungeons you can gaze here at any time. Do not forget this. Yep, yeah, I was gonna say that eventually. So watch out for those. Watch out for some the enemies in this dungeon. They cannot be stunned. It should, well, it makes a no effect sound on the door. Never knew that before. Yeah, you hit these switches to make these blocks rise and fall. You can cross the current color it's on. Yeah, I was just, the only reason I threw the boomerang is to show off that this guy's immune, indeed immune to the boomerang. My health already cut in half. This could, this will, this will certainly go well. Let's see what's in here. Is this a, yeah. Alright, this sword technique seems to be holding out very well. Letting, the, letting them stab themselves. Seems to be the best strategy here. All right, let's let's do this. hit on you with a spin attack in your history. Oh man, a big thing in those would be a nightmare. Oops, sorry. Dropped the pot. That was my mighty lantern. You will light the lamps and end the oppression. Get our hands on the big key! Yeah! Charge! I remember. And the tiles remain defeated! Looks like I need to hit a switch again. Get out of here! Now it's time to go up the tower, naturally. You guys take a few hits. Ow. And if you fall off these edges, you fall down to the previous floor. Yeah, this guy likes a pot to the face! You can also drop those guys down the hole for a quicker way to kill them. Oops, sorry. 
Yeah, these stars will change the, the holes in the ground. Make holes appear where holes are not, and we'll make holes disappear where holes are not. That was weird. Now these guys also bounce you back, so you have to be careful around fighting them around holes. Just the holes accordingly. Does it only take three hits? I thought they took a lot more. This is why you wanted to drop them down the holes. Do also, due to their launch, how much, uh, well, you launched them. Shut up! Thank you. Found the compass. Now you can pinpoint the lair of the dungeon's evil master. Yeah. Oh! That's what those, those two weirdos were saying in the dark world. Escape! Yeah, because you can beat this, totally beat this dungeon without the moon pearl. It's true. But you absolutely need the moon pearl to beat the game. So here's something I want to show off. Go down here to get some fairies. You need some help. And it warps you right back up. Jump for these red ones. These red ones take quite a bit of hits. Unless you just drop them in the hole. There's a bunch of stuff here, hearts and stuff. Don't bother with these walls. See, they're no they're 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 not cracked at all. Not, you can't blow them up. All right. And now, time for the boss. I do not know what this thing's name is. Let's take him on. It's a giant caterpillar thing. Nuts! So big he wouldn't drop me. Alright, let's take that guy on again! I have a fairy, I'm not afraid at all. Charge! All right, all right, come on, come on, come on. Gotcha! Twice. Three times. This guy's debatably the hardest boss in the game. Of course, that's debatable. Hopefully I won't be spending this whole video on him. I usually can beat this guy in like one try. 
I don't know why I'm having so much trouble right now. Right, come on, let's do it! One! Alright. I'm do doing an okay job of staying on. But he's been knocking me toward the pits. But he's been knocking me toward the pits too much. Three! Four! Five! Oh, come on! I was running away from the pit! That was terrible. How does that work? I don't think spin attack does any extra damage to this guy. Ah! I think one more hit. Fairy time! Gotcha! Ha ha! Give me your heart, foul beast, and just give me that pendant. Oh snap! I forgot the moon pearl. Hold that thought. All right, all right, all right. I can talk again. Now, in order to get to the moon pearl, you gotta activate that and come up here from the top. And voila! The moon pearl protects the hero from the changing effects of the golden power. And now let's show off the magic mirror. Magic. Back to the start. And leave the... bail from this place. And as of then, and all right, this time, all right, we beat the Tower of Hera. Right, we have all three pendants. So next time, um, we're going to be running a few errands, of course, and naturally going to pick up the legendary Master Sword on Let's Play The Legend of Zelda: A Link to the Past. I am level 27 Marker Man, and I would like to thank everybody who sees this for watching. Bye!